dear students you know that uh, mrts that is the marginal rate of technical substitution is a very important concept when it comes to producer equilibrium analysis we shall today learn how we can do it using the implicit differentiation let us see we are assuming that we have a production function which actually could have been written like this right however what we did is humne isko transform kiya and we wrote it in an implicit functional form and that actually was the original form of it using this implicit functional form we can come up with the results of the mrts that is the slope of isoquant so before we go there humne ek condition ko set karna hai that is that for mrts delta q is equal to 0 and that is quite evident from this diagram aap dekh sakte hain ki jo isoquant hoti hai uski precondition ye hai ki output ka level will remain the same that is the change in output will be equal to 0 ye condition aisi useful condition hai that can allow us to do the implicit differentiation let us see what we see here in this case is the application of uh, the uh, you know implicit differentiation on this case of production function which have these three variables that is output capital lip however capital uh, however the output is kept constant as we are talking about an isoquant yahan par humne capital ko labor pe dependent kiya ek chain dependence create karne ke liye aur right hand side pe agar hum derivative calculate karenge the answer will be zero so here the chain dependence is now expanded with the help of chain rule of differentiation so um this is the indirect uh, expansion and this is the direct expansion the differentiation now in this case is the total differentiation now we can extract this value ise hum left hand side pe likh lenge aur baki values ko invert karke hum left hand side right hand side pe shift karenge and you know that delta f over delta l can be written as f of l and delta f over delta k can be written as f of k and this will appear with a minus sign now we need to interpret this result ise hum mrts to kahenge hi but it is also showing the rate of change of capital due to the rate of change of labor the trade off between labor and capital while keeping output constant it is actually delta q equal to 0 that the change in delta is equal to 0 now it is equal to this negative value and we can guess that a negative value shows a negative slope the isoquant is negatively sloped so this is how by using this implicit form we have tried to extract the marginal rate of technical substitution of an isoquant thank you